So of course I got my hand on not one, but two of those. The cute little C that you see that right there in the front is what also sold me. But for the most part, she's still gonna hold up. Yeah, sometimes we'll feel a little Hey family, hey, what's going on? Welcome. If you're new, welcome back if you've been, you guys. All right, so Yancy here. Welcome back to Bag of the Week, you guys. Shop my closet, all right? So we have started Bag of the Week, you guys, for the year. It is all because of it's a no-buy year, and we're continuing strong. We are now in week seven, you guys, and as you see by the title, it is going to be another coach bag, which I'm actually really excited about because I was excited when I got this particular bag, you guys, so yeah. So either which way, before we get into bag of the week, before we jump into it, you guys, let me first start off by saying welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Yancy. My channel is all about luxury, lifestyle, and travel. Yes, we will be doing a lot more traveling this year and continuing on through the future, all right? So if you're here for luxury bags, if you're here for luxury reviews, unboxings, clothing hauls, so on and so forth, you guys, and if the video and the channel is for you, go ahead and think about subscribing. I would greatly appreciate it. Do not, I repeat, do not forget to like the videos, you guys. Do not forget to hit the bell notification. That way you're notified every single time I upload. That way I don't miss you, you don't miss me, and we're here, all right? Because this is where I want you to be. I want you to be part of the will. I want you to be a part of the family, and I want you to join in all the festivities that is this channel that's growing, and I'm loving it, and I'm loving you guys. So if you know some family members, if you know some friends, coworkers, whoever would love and enjoy this channel, some vlogs here or there, some traveling, some bag reviews, so on and so forth, Go ahead and let them know about me and subscribe, all right? Because once again, if you subscribe, if you like, it tells the algorithm that more people need to watch and it pushes out the videos and it pushes out the channel. So go ahead and do that. I would greatly appreciate it because it is literally just a few seconds just to hit that button, you guys. It does not cost a thing. It is completely free. Go ahead and push it. Help your girl out. All right, <laughs> all right. In which way, let's go ahead and get to the bag because I'm excited. And I actually really am excited for all of the bags that I've been using for the past few weeks because it really is getting me to get to use all my bags that I've been neglecting that I literally need to use because, you know, when you look around and you use the same bags over and over, you're like, oh, I don't have anything. But you do. Look into your closet, shop your closet, you know, reuse your stuff or purge your stuff. So we will definitely get into purging our closet in the next videos, all right? If we haven't already, but it's never too late to do it. So either which way, let me stop talking, let me stop ranting, let's get into this bag. All right, you guys, so like I said, as you see by the title, we are looking at the beautiful, the stunning Coach Pillow Tabby. Yes, the Pillow Tabby, you guys, the absolutely a stunning bag that was all over TikTok, all over Instagram, all over YouTube. Everyone was fighting for this bag and for good reason. This bag is so cute, so fluffy. It feels so good and I love it. I'm glad I got my hands on it because it took a minute to actually get this bag and I think I had to get it from another store in another state, but I got my hands on her. So I'm excited. I'm happy. I don't care. Um, at the time that she came out, there was rumors that they were coming out with a smaller one. This is the Coach Pillow Tabby 26. And then I think a few months later, they came out with the Coach Pillow Tabby 18. So of course I got my hand on not one, but two of those because they had so many different colors. I didn't know what to choose from, but I'll probably put that in rotation for the back of the week, all right? So just have to stay tuned. You have to stay tuned to see what bags I put in rotation for bag of the week for the year, all right? So if you're loving the bag of the week series, go ahead and subscribe and hit the bell notification. That way you are notified every single time you see this bag of the week notification come up, you guys, all right? And all my other videos, of course, all right? So either which way, let's get into this. So this pillow tabby, once again, she came out about a few years ago, you guys, and everyone was trying to get their hands on her. And I was literally calling all of my coach essays to see if I can get my hands on this bag. 
um, because I definitely needed to have this coach pillow tabby. My husband was actually even trying to get it for me as well. Um, so I was so forever grateful. Um, but yeah, either which way, if I'm not mistaken, I think it came with, no, that was a different bag. So no, this came um, unscathed, no issues, whatever. Um, so I was really happy about that. It does come with two straps. Um, as you can see, this shorter handle that's right here. And then it also comes with a longer strap. So we're gonna do what we do. We're gonna get into the dimensions, quick reviews, and then you can get the gist of all of this beauty, all right? All right, so off the top, you guys, dimensions. This is 10.25 inches in length, six inches in height, and three inches in depth. So, I mean, she's a shoulder bag. She's a bag that holds your necessities. You're not gonna get her to hold a huge amount of items, but this is a great going out bag. It's a great running errands bag if you wanted to. You wouldn't have any issues. She fits a lot. There's no exterior pocket on here, so I'm okay with that. She does have a snap closure. The cute little C that you see, that right there in the front is what also sold me. It's so adorable. Um, of course, if you know Coach, you're gonna know what that C stands for. I mean, the puffiness you have to get used to because she will, you know, have a little bit of wear. She will kind of get really slouchy or whatever, but you know, that's just what makes the bag. So either which way, you have three compartments, one, two, and then the zipper compartment that's right here. If you want your items to be a little bit more secure, definitely put them in the zipper compartment because you won't have any issues. Just close her up and you're good to go. But I think for the most part, she fits, like I said, what you need her to fit and you're good to go. So this is the shoulder strap with a 7.75 inch drop. Um, I can get her over my shoulder, but for the most part, she's not really that comfortable. So, I mean, I do tend to just hold her um, as a top handle or quick on my arm and I'm good to go. Um, for the most part, I will always put the longer strap on, which is a crossbody strap. Both are detachable, so I love that. I always love a detachable, removable strap, you guys, because it just makes it so versatile. You could do so much with it. If you wanted to, you can easily take all the straps off and use her as a clutch as well, because you know, it's your bag, do what you want. All right, so here is the crossbody strap. She has a 21.25 inch drop, you guys. You actually have about seven holes to adjust the strap to your preferred height. Um, according to your body. Um, I always like her to be a little bit longer. You guys know me if you've been following me for a while. I like for all of my bags, if the straps are adjustable, to sit right at my hip because it's easier for me to kind of like get to. That way there's no issues or anything like that. But yeah, for the most part, if I'm going, if I'm really just running errands, then the shorter strap is on. If I'm going to be out and about and I want to be hands-free, I'm adding the crossbody strap and I'm adjusting her and I'm hands-free all day. Um, the only issue that I had, which I actually need to go back to the coach store and see if they can get me like an extra little, um, I don't even know what I would call it. So yeah, it's kind of like, okay, so you know how the hang tag hangs off of the bag. Um, the one thing that I did have an issue with was this actually would come off. I don't know if it was just mine, if anybody else had that issue, whatever like that, but the chain detail that attaches from this hang tag to the bag, it came off, I lost it, but I wind up finding and seeing the hang tag that fell right on the ground where the car was or whatever, which I was really happy about because I did not want to lose this because it literally is very pillowy as well because of course it matches the bag. So I still have this by itself. I just need to go and get the little chain detail and see if they can replace that for me, which I'm sure they can. Um, but yeah, that was the only gripe that I had. And I think it was just my bag because all of my other pillow tabbies don't do that. So I think it was just this one where the chain detail probably was just a little bit loose. So yeah. Either which way, like I said, I use the crossbody strap and I actually put her on the furthest hole. That way she can be really comfortable. I have broader shoulders, so I like for her to sit um, a little bit longer um, and feel a little bit comfortable. And I do like the thickness of this particular strap. So yeah. All right, so this is smooth leather. As you can see, it will get scratched if you're not careful. But I mean, I've had her for a while. There are no feet at the bottom. Um, I haven't had any issues. I don't set her on the ground if I'm going to go eat. She is sitting right next to me, either on a chair or on top of the table. Um, but, you know, 
she's held up. Like I said, she's going to have, you know, some wear and tear because she's a little bit squishy. So, you know, that's what you're going to see. You're going to see all of this kind of like, you know, settle, I guess if you would. But for the most part, she's still going to hold up because she's a very because it's a very nice leather on this particular bag. But again, like I told you before, when it comes to coach, the quality of the bags, they have not skipped on. So um, they've done a great job. I will not ever have any issues spending my money when it comes to coach, because I know I'm gonna get great quality. Whereas nowadays, you do have a lot more other um, designer bags, um, you know, designer fashion houses that are just pushing out items and the bags are not really up to par and the increase in pricing is just becoming ridiculous but i think for sure you were definitely going to get good quality bags in coach and kate spade and toy birch and you guys definitely need to invest in that all right so that is my spiel when it comes to coach bags and lower designer type of bags don't sleep on them because you're gonna get great quality all right and this coach pillow tappy is no exception so yeah. All right, you guys, so now that you've gotten the quick rundown on that beautiful bag, let's go ahead and see what fits in the coach pillow tabby. You don't care what you're doing to me. I've been down in the ruins so deep. All the games they play, all the love you've forsaken, you let it slip away. Oh, 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 oh. You don't care what you're doing to me Every setback, every mishap, every time you say you gon' change Say you get it, you regret it, I forgive it, but you stay the same You should cry an ocean for me For the dumb shit and the damage you've done Cause I've been crying oceans for weeks Try to fight it but I'm drowning alone Sister, save me now Save me now Whoa. Sister, save me now Save me now Whoa. All right, you guys, so that is it. Hopefully you got a chance to see what fits in her. Hopefully you saw everything that works for me. Hopefully it can work for you. They still have Coach Pillow Tabbies available on Coach at Nordstrom's, Neiman Marcus. You guys, you can always get her secondhand as well. Go ahead and invest in the Coach Pillow Tabby. I tell you no lie, you will not regret it. It is a beautiful bag. It's a cute bag. It's definitely a conversation starter because everybody is in love with the Pillow Tabby and she still works to this day, all right? So you're not gonna have any issues. She never goes out of style, in my opinion, all right? So... Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And I will see you in the next video, you guys. Bye. Sister, save 